One of the big things that Labor's taking to the election is our cheaper childcare policy. Under Scott Morrison, childcare costs have risen twice, more than twice as fast as wages. Um, this is Amanda. Hello. Amanda's Labor's Shadow Minister for Childcare. So if we win the election, she'll be in charge of childcare for Australia. Yeah, that's a big job. You big blame job. her for everything. <laughs> Amanda's also one of the nicest and hardest working people in the parliament. Um, before she was in Parliament, she was actually a clinical psychologist. Yes, that's right. Which makes you very caring and also a little bit disturbing that she's diagnosing <laughs> all of us. You're fine. Yeah, we're fine. Thanks. <laughs> Excellent. Um, and she actually has small children. This is not a prop. No. Sometimes they come to Canberra. <laughs> they but, do. Um, Ch Amanda, could you explain in simple terms why are we putting so much focus on childcare? Why does it matter? Well, families are struggling with cost of living at the moment and one of the biggest cost of living uh, pressures is indeed childcare. It's actually stopping often women going back to work and working more hours. So that's not good for families, obviously, because that's really difficult. But it's also not good uh, for the economy because we hear now that businesses are having trouble finding workers. Well, if you can't afford to go back to work because of childcare, then businesses won't get the skilled workers either. Well summarised, you've done this before. I have, I have indeed. <laughs> I feel uncomfortable sometimes even though saying childcare because mm. I passionately believe it's early education. Um, it's one of the best investments we can make for the future of our country, but childcare is what everyone says and talks about in common language. Um, the other question, childcare is so complex, like it makes people's heads explode, parents trying to understand the system. Um, how do you explain what are, what's Labor's policy? What are we actually trying to do? Well, firstly, in the short term, what we're really trying to do is decrease those out-of-pocket costs for families. So increase the subsidy for everyone in the system. But in the long term, we want to move towards a universal 90% subsidy system to get rid of the means testing and all the complexity, the barriers that are put up by Centrelink often uh, to actually getting support. So uh, short term, improve that cost, but long term, look at a universal access uh, system that is good for children, good for families and good for the economy. That is really exciting and you can't underestimate how big this is. It was Labor that introduced Medicare, a universal Absolutely. health system. We have universal primary schools where parents don't have their income tested when they send their kids to primary school. That's and right. so that's Labor's vision, a universal childcare system. That's absolutely it because we see early education slash childcare as uh, more commonly known as an essential service, not some sort of family welfare payment. Excellent. Well done. You should be the minister. Oh, I hope so. Fingers crossed. <laughs>